But when I first started and I didn't know anything and I was nobody and I, and I, and I had nothing really of value, you know, I was a fly on the wall in probably maybe 10 different groups all within the warrior program with people from different markets. I'm just trying to learn, trying to get along. And, and I, I quickly came to the, well, not quickly, because obviously I went through 10 freaking groups, but over time I learned that I cannot surround myself with people who are essentially the same as me. Because if you think about, if you think about that multifamily, right? When you look at the general partnership, essentially there's only maybe four, maybe five roles. Yeah. Acquisitions, KP, capital raising, uh, asset manager, maybe earnest money, but you know, or at risk capital, but typically just four roles, right? If your only real way to add value into a group is by finding a deal or finding the money, then the people who would complement your skills that you need to get in good with are asset managers, right? People who are operators or high net worth individuals like KPs, right? These guys might have money, but they may not have the ability to analyze a deal. They don't have time for it. They don't want to do it. So you're like, yeah, let me go ahead and I found this deal. It's going to be great. I think you should KP on it and blah, 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 whatever. You bring the KP to the deal. Maybe you guys can have some sort of arrangement, right? Uh, or maybe it's a deal that you found that you want to be uh, the head honcho on or you want to run it. And you bring it to an operator and you're like, hey, can we partner on this together? 